According to astrology, our personalities are strongly influenced by our zodiac signs. These ingrained personalities also play a role in our overall zodiac compatibility and who we find attractive. And sometimes, that person is your complete opposite. Dating is hard enough, but when you add in the fact that you might be dating someone totally different from you, it can be hard to see why this is much better than dating someone who could be your twin. Here are the opposite zodiac signs that attract each other like crazy. Aries and Libra. The two of you might seem way too opposite from one another. You are both too driven by different things to be considered a perfect match, and yet you are. Your differences are what make you such a great couple. You might both be a bit stubborn and you know, can argue until the cows come home, but you are also master charmers. When you get caught under the other's spell, it's very hard for either of you to say no to love. There's something exciting about taking risks and having fun, and when you bring a fire sign and an air sign together, your energies amplify this excitement. Aries, you can teach Libra to let loose every once in a while without feeling guilty or exhausted. Meanwhile, Libra, you can teach Aries to fight fair and be more reasonable in her expectations in life. Taurus and Scorpio, you are both incredibly passionate and sensual individuals, making your partnership something of a fairy tale when it comes to dealings in the bedroom. Both of your zodiac signs are very accomplished, but you each wish you could succeed as easily as the other can, in your own way. Taurus, you know how to weather even the toughest situations without giving up. While Scorpio, you know that it takes a lot of smarts and determination to flourish. What each of you is missing in qualities is exactly what the other sign has, which makes your opposites attract story so interesting. In a room, you'll be the most attractive couple. Your signs are physically matched as well. In communication, Taurus, you tend to be more straightforward than Scorpio, who tends to be more intuitive. Your differences just help you two to play off of each other's strengths by being different. Both of your zodiac signs are super loyal and will go to the ends of the earth for each other when deep in love. Gemini and Sagittarius. You both have two different personalities depending on your mood. So while neither of you always feels the same thing at the same time, you do understand each other. It takes a special person to know what it's like to be outgoing and chat one minute and quiet and reserved the next. This mutual understanding makes your relationship stronger than most because there's no question as to why either of you is acting differently, seemingly out of nowhere. Your two zodiac signs make the best friendship, which is important to keeping your relationship intact. Of course, Gemini, you can sometimes be sneaky, whereas Sagittarius, you would rather tell it like it is. There can be some miscommunication, but they make up for this by being friends before lovers and by using their shared interests to stay close. Cancer and Capricorn. Cancer and Capricorn are highly attracted to each other thanks to the common ground they share. Being both very successful and driven, signs that see change in life as smart and important. There's a lot for the two of them to connect on. Family and love are also important to them, and they tend to have similar ideas when it comes to dating, sex, and marriage. Cancer is more likely to be the extroverted one with the busier social life, while Capricorn tends to be more introverted and a homebody. But these opposites still play an important role. There will be times when Cancer wants to just stay home, and when Capricorn wants to go out and party, giving this couple a healthy dose of both worlds. While Cancer can have many different moods in one day, Capricorn is more level-headed, giving Cancer someone to talk to when they're feeling especially out of sorts. Leo and Aquarius. Leo loves to be in charge and to take command of a room, which means that there also needs to be a sense of order for them to be able to control. For Aquarius, it's the exact opposite. There's no need to be in control for them when they believe in embracing the craziness of life. And if that doesn't drive Leo nuts sometimes, Aquarius's coolness will. Aquarius is not the type of person to share love with just anyone, whereas Leo tends to be very warm and passionate. Of course, there are people in an Aquarius's life that see a much warmer side. But Aquarius tends to reserve it for people who will accept them for who they really are. Leo tends to worry too much about what others think of them. But with Aquarius around, Leo tends to relax a lot more. And with Leo, Aquarius finds that kindness and friendliness goes a long way. Virgo and Pisces. Virgo may be almost too reserved in life, while Pisces might be more of a walking tornado than a person, but there's still a mutual fascination in this relationship they might both have their fears and worry about different things, but whatever one is going through, the other is willing to help as much as possible. There will always be something one sign can't figure out that the other can. 
Both signs are incredibly unselfish and love affection, so there's never a shortage of intimacy. Pisces tends to go more with the flow of life, though, while Virgo tries to stay as grounded and thoughtful as possible. This can lead to some tension, but when one sign sees the best traits this mindset can bring in the other, acceptance for who each other is always trumps tension and annoyance. While there will always be something a little uneasy about dating your complete opposite, it can actually be the best thing for your relationship. The opposite zodiac signs perfectly balance each other out, which explains why you might feel such a strong attraction to them. Opposites attract for a reason. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe to your tango for more on your zodiac signs.